This is the State of Things. I'm Frank Stacio. We're live today from the North Carolina Museum of Natural Sciences. We're live streaming. Go to our website, stateofthings.org, if you want to watch this show. And there's a lot to watch now because I'm about to introduce you to the Mint Julep Jazz Band. It's a big swing band. They have been together for quite a while. The Mint Julep Jazz Band recreates the sound of jazz clubs from the 20s through the 40s. This year voted the best musical artist in Durham Magazine. Congratulations. And uh, their followers uh, aren't just local, though. They have a vast majority of their support that comes from the global swing dance community. They're going to be playing tomorrow night, 7 o'clock, at the Cookery in Durham. It's a fundraiser and a rent party, in fact, for a group called Housing for New Hope. It's a rent party that helps that group, which is involved in aid for people who are homeless. The Mint Julep Jazz Band features Laura Winley on vocals, Lucian Cobb on the trombone, Keenan McKenzie on tenor, Aaron Hill on alto, Paul Rogers on trumpet, Ben Lasseter on guitar, Jason Foreman on bass, and Aaron Tucker on the drums, the Mint Julep Jazz Band. Welcome. Good to have you here. Thank you. It's great to be here. And congratulations on that, uh, on that award. So tell us about this now. Laura, you've been uh, swing dancing for about 15 years, right? Traveled all over the country. Is that right? That's correct. I started swing dancing when I was in high school, and it just sort of grew from this uh, very small hobby into something that I would say is a little bit more than a hobby at this point, uh, now that I am uh, co-running a band. But I, I DJ, and I have traveled all over the United States and competed, and, uh, and I still do the, all of these things. And how did the band come together? Well, you know, it's a bit of necessity, actually, because... Um, we uh, we had been playing together, some of us in another group, and um, that kind of stalled out. But people still loved to hear Laura sing and, and hear the rest of us play. So they, we were getting uh, contacted saying, you know, could you put something together? Could you do something? We had to think about it and say, well, can we? You or know? do we want to? Right. <laughs> so, so we tried it out, and it seems to have worked well so far. Sounds very good. Could you uh, do a song for us? Sure. Mint Julep Jazz Band. They're going to be playing tomorrow night at the Cookery in Durham. It's a fundraiser for Housing for New Hope, a rent party, in fact. Wow, what a great song.
That's amazing. Thank you. That's a really one. And that song, One Girl, Two Boys, right, featured in the famous 1943 film, Swing Fever, is that Swing right? Swing Fever. And it was written, and the film starred Kay Kaiser, who is a native North Carolinian and longtime Chapel Hill resident. Yeah, Kay Kaiser, big band leader uh, in that era, right? Absolutely. And uh, one other reason we chose this, other than the North Carolina collect or connection, is uh, it's also, this particular film has a very famous swing dance scene that's done to the song and uh, features some very famous dancers. So it's, it's uh, when we play this at dances, it's instantly recognizable and everyone, everyone knows the clip. Well, and your version of the song was featured in the film that won the Jazz Dance Film Festival. Is that right? Am I right that's correct. That? Uh, Seattle has a Jazz Dance Film Fest every year and um, Jennifer Lee, a Seattle dancer, put together a film and used this song essentially as the uh, storyline and soundtrack to her film. Uh, do you try, when you recreate these songs, you try to be very faithful to a particular version of them. How much do you allow yourself to improvise? And it depends. Um, for this particular tune, you know, being in the film, um, everyone kind of knows it. They know it when they hear it. So we want to make sure that people can make that connection. But um, other tunes, you know, we try to put our own spin on things as much as we can, for sure. Will you do that right now? Sure. Mint Julep Jazz Band, they're going to be at the Cookery in Durham for a rent party. It's a fundraiser for Housing for New Hope. They're here with us live. By the way, we're live streaming, so if you want to watch this show, you, because we are at the, natural, uh, uh, the Museum of Natural Sciences in Raleigh, live streaming, stateofthings.org is the place to watch. Mint Julep Jazz Band is the group you're about to hear. Mississippi, draw me closer, where every girl's a pretty melody, every skyscraper's just a tree, and serve the best in hospitality, get it southern style, get it southern style.
empty bales of cotton powder, row on row. At steamboats on the Delta, make your heart a melt to shout. Oh, Mississippi, draw me closer, where every girl's a pretty melody. Every skyscraper's just a tree, and serve the best in hospitality. Get it Southern style. Get it Southern style. The Mint Julep Jazz Band live here at the North Carolina Museum of Natural Sciences. If you want to find out how to get to their fundraiser tomorrow and get tickets to their fundraiser in Durham, you can go to our website, stateofthings.org. There is also a link for the live stream of this so you can watch the show. Another great song. Laura, tell us about this. It's one thing to be dancing to this music. When did you start singing this music? Um, well, it kind of, well, other than in the shower, you know, <laughs> like, um, I, I, I DJ this music, and so I'm, I'm very intimately in love with this music. And so I, I started singing um, the summer after law school. I went to one of Luke's rehearsals, and I was just hanging out. And um, they were auditioning vocalists for this band, and they said, Hey, Laura, can you just come up and sing this so we know where it falls in the chart? And I guess I did better than the <laughs> vocalists who auditioned, and I, and I got the job. So that's, that's how I started singing jazz. That song that we just heard, Lucian, maybe this is a question that you can answer, because I understand that that song, Get It Southern Style, is actually a lesser-known Duke Ellington song. It is. It is an Ellington tune, and it's one that you don't hear very often. And as soon as I heard it, and I said, that's one that we've definitely got to do. Uh, we have a lot of Ellington tunes in the book, and because uh, I'm a big fan. And uh, like I said, when we heard that one, I knew it was one we had to do. Maybe I'm going to ask you to play Miami Boulevard next, and you can tell us a little bit about it, because this is an original tune. This right? is the only original tune um, on our CD that we just released recently, uh, and it was written by our tenor player, Mr. Keenan McKenzie. Uh, we'll play it for you now. Let's go.
Mint Julep Jazz Band, a song called Miami Boulevard. They're going to be playing live at the Cookery tomorrow night. Rent party, very briefly, Laura, tell us about this rent party and uh, a little bit about the, the fundraiser for Housing for New Hope, right? Well, Rent Party as a concept uh, began uh, in the 1920s and 30s in Harlem, and it was sort of uh, set up as you hire a band, and you have some food, and you open up your house, and you charge admission. And the idea was that you get enough money, hopefully, to pay the rent for the month. Um, with Housing for New Hope, we sort of translated this into... Um, or it's really related to Housing for New Hope's purpose, which is to provide assistance for homeless people, but also to uh, provide rent, ass rent assistance to people who may be r at risk of losing their homes. So the whole purpose of this fundraiser is to raise the rent. And so the, m the funds raised uh, t tomorrow at the cookery will go to all of Housing for New Hope's services, and uh, essentially helping people pay their rent. Great plan, great cause, great music, and great venue. Thank you for being on the program. Thanks so much for having us. Mint Julep Jazz Band is going to play tomorrow night, 7 o'clock, Cookery Housing for New Hope's inaugural rent party. And that's our program for today. Thanks for listening. This is North Carolina Public Radio. It's a broadcast service of the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. I'm Frank Stacio. Once again, the Mint Julep Jazz Band. Cart, honey, better be ready about half past eight. I mean, don't be late. I'll be there when the band starts playing. Remember when we get there, honey? Shim sham, when them all dance all over my shoes. When the band plays the jelly roll blues, say tomorrow.